just like the song, Proud Mary starts out nice and easy and ends up nice and rough. Well, every so often you got to go through some tough vegetables, some tough fruits. How do you handle these guys? The Mr. Skull knives are light, they're sharp, and they're easy to use. But sometimes when you're dealing with something that's got a tougher skin, like a pumpkin, a spaghetti squash or something, you're up against a little bit more of a challenge. In comes the Messerstall Asian Cleaver. Beautiful little cleaver. It's got some more heft to it. It's got a nice thick back to it. And it's got a nice sharp edge. And if you don't believe it, or if you want, you can give it a... It too can be trued on your diamond steel. Put that back. Get back down. How are we going to handle this? We know that there's a pocket of seeds somewhere right there. So it's hollow right there. This is all solid. You got the tip, you got the bag. So let's cut through it. That was so easy. Tip down, slide down, cut. Right? Get a little get a little bit of grip on it. So yeah, just get a little bit in there. Down, down. So now you've created a pedestal for your uh, butternut squash. Doesn't matter because I'm gonna cut the solid part off through like that now you've got the top you can cut this now you peel it just like i peeled pineapple just peel it down just by sliding back and forth start it up at the top and you got yourself 100 percent butternut squash butternut squash is so delicious I mean, it's sticky, it's, it's fantastic. This part here, just cut it in half. Well, you, again, you peel it down, cut it in half, scrape out the seeds. It's a little slippery because it's nice and fresh. That is how you handle a tougher vegetable. Okay, so we got acorn squash here. Acorn squash, same kind of deal. Just cut the ends off, easy, easy. Again, cut it in half, scrape out the seeds. Peel it down. You can peel it with this. You can use it. You can use a little paring knife as well if you want, just to kind of peel down the edges. But it's just as easy to hold it up and cut it down the sides. So that's how you handle the tougher, rougher. You know, you think you're in a bad neighborhood? Not if you're armed.